Bees make the world go round. We asked Dr. Ashley Samanchi, what is royal jelly? A bee cells mean that there will be a queen bee coming out of this. So when they see a big cell like this, uh, they put a baby bee in it and they put a lot of royal jelly in it. That is how the royal jelly is produced. We are not taking the royal jelly that is necessary for the baby bees in the hive. This is fresh royal jelly. When it is extracted, it, it has to be keep cold. Look at it, it's cold. So she cuts the big cell a little bit. So you see the royal jelly in there? This is the royal jelly. In, and in it, there is the baby bee, the larva. You see that? Okay. Now she's taking the baby bee out and putting it into another cell temporarily. That's a baby bee? Yeah, that's a baby bee. We call it larva, a grown, a little bit grown larva. And she's putting it, uh, yeah, yeah, she's just putting it there temporarily. And she will put it back. Yeah, she will extract it and put it back and they will uh, go on uh, growing with honey and pollen. Because after three days, they need honey and pollen. For the first three days, they just need royal jelly. Royal jelly stage is finished, so she, she's taking the excess royal jelly. They are already three days older, so the royal jelly feeding is finished. They will now, Go on eating honey and pollen. Now she will put the larva back so that they go on growing. It's not for that. It's not. It's not. 